absolutely can't get any clothes on here. Does not ever get off this mat. Understand, Sherry? Good job. Jazzy, is this your new dollhouse? Yes! <gasps> Show me! Jacob still refuses to wear clothes. <laughs> Jacob is currently loving to watch people unwrap lollies <laughs> on YouTube. Such a fascinating video. Is it? You look like Little Red Riding Hood. Welcome to today's video. Today we thought we'd bring up the camera because we haven't vlogged in a really, really, really long time. I can't really show you Jacob at the moment because he is not clothed as per our last video. We talked about it. He's not wearing clothes and still not wearing clothes a week, a week after we've gone out away for the weekend. So I don't know what's up with that. I don't, his OT reckons that it's because it's a thing that he can control and he's anxious and you know his routine was thrown out so that is the reason yeah we just absolutely can't get any clothes on him his school has like once or twice been able to get clothes on him but for the most part we're dropping him off and they have to wrap a towel around him right now we're going to be going to the grocery store because we have got no food in our fridge and I'm gonna show you how that goes. He will wear a nappy when we go out. So we'll see how that goes. I might wrap a towel or a blanket around him. Are you gonna just wear a blanket, Jacob? I guess that's what's gonna have to work. We ready to go, princess? What did you get from the shop? You got the stretchy man. And Jazzy got some eggs for an Easter egg hunt. Yeah. In the house. In the house? Cool. Jacob actually kept his clothes on. We had a dress in the car. We were actually just gonna wrap him in a towel and then all of a sudden he, Jordan got the dress on him. Are you bringing all your blankets out? You've got a dress on too. So I'm glad we got something on him today, otherwise we wouldn't be able to go anywhere. Now he's bringing all his, <laughs> he always does this. Every day brings out the blankets. Okay, I can help you. Every day he brings out all the blankets. All of them come out and he chills out here. <laughs> we got a special delivery. I am interrupting this vlog to tell you about the newest addition to our playroom. I'm talking about the Neptune Blanket Mellow Mat. This has been the best addition to our family's life, our family's house. We even have one in Jacob's room as well. The Mellow Mat is a 30 millimeter thick, slow rebound memory foam mat, perfect for any activity on the floor. Since we got this mat, oh, I'm more than happy to get down and play with them. Um, as opposed to before, we had we have really hard floors and I'm just so, so happy that we got to collaborate with Neptune Blanket today for this video because seriously, if you guys could feel this, we've had a few people come to our house and they've gone, what is this mat? 
we need it. Like it is so comfortable, so heavenly soft. In the mornings we tend to all bring our blankets out to the lounge room and we lie down on the mat and we chill out. It's also been such a good sensory tool for Jacob's sensory needs. He loves this blanket. I'll show you some footage of when we first got it. This was his reaction to it. Ever since he just does not ever get off this mat. We have the huge size out in the lounge room, but we put a large size in Jacob's room to fit his room, but it's been so good for his swing because he has an indoor swing, especially because he has elephant feet. I used to come tumbling down the playroom here and he has really like loud feet, especially during the night. It's been such a good soundproof for him. And I'm not gonna lie, my kids are the messiest human beings ever. Oh my gosh, there's been spills, there's been crumbs, there's been everything on this mat and it is so easy to clean. If you guys would like to try a Neptune blanket today and get a mellow mat for yourself, I'll leave the link down in the description for you to go check them out. Getting comfy? You want your toy? This is so weird. And in the kitchen, Jordan is making the famous Tempe. Random night tempeh wrap. We've got corn chips, lettuce, hummus, and tempeh, barbecue sauce, and avocado is optional. It's the best thing ever. Would you like some juice? Say juice. I've noticed more lately that Jacob's been saying words under like his mouth. Does that make sense? Like he'll say it like, he won't open the mouth. yeah, he won't open his mouth, but he'll say the word. Are you gonna hide all the eggs? Yeah. And mommy's gonna find them? Yeah. Okay, ready, set, go. go. Hold his own. Oh, you found another one. You found the last one. Jess is wanting me to repeat what I just said. Jacob recently has become more sociable and he wants to do what Jazz is doing. She wanted to play with the eggs, so Jacob wanted to play with the eggs. Jazzy was playing with a new dollhouse, Jacob wanted to play with a new dollhouse. Jazz is lying down now watching some iPad and Jacob went, saw her watching the iPad, grabbed his iPad and now he's lying down with the iPad. It's kind of really cute, but at the, at the same time, Jazz <coughs> is having a bit of difficulty learning about sharing because of the fact that Jacob doesn't exactly understand sharing and he generally just gets what he wants. And I think that makes it hard for Jazz to understand that she has to share, but he doesn't. Not to the same level. You, you, you guys know what I mean. Like... Okay, Jacob, open! Open! Okay, hold on to it. Yeah. Put it in 
job. And shake, 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 shake. Yummy juice. 